everyone, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video is going to be a collab with two crazy guinea pigs and I'll be doing the do's and she'll be doing the don'ts about guinea pig care. So yeah, make sure to subscribe to her channel, it's an amazing channel and let's get into this video. Guinea pigs need a large enclosure to stay happy and healthy. So give your guinea pig a large enclosure and I love DIY enclosures because the, you can just make them as big as you want and they're really great enclosures and you can make them as big as you want, you can make them as wide as you want. They are a really good choice of enclosures and literally guinea pigs need they need exercise to stay happy and healthy so you do need to give your guinea pig a large enclosure and so that's why i also really love diy enclosures do try to give them a friend guinea pigs are social animals and they love being with other guinea pigs i am aware that it doesn't always work out but it's always best if you can try and get your guinea pig a friend so you can get a few more guinea pigs as well and bond them as a herd but um, definitely try to bond your guinea pigs but i am aware that it doesn't always work out do give them unlimited hay. Hay is a huge part of a guinea pig's diet, so make sure to give them lots of fresh hay. Keep on checking on your guinea pig's hay to make sure that they aren't out of any hay because whenever it's low you should always top up their hay because they should always have an unlimited amount of hay. My ski! And also hay like wears down their teeth so they don't get dental problems as well which is really really good so you need to make sure that your guinea pig has unlimited hay do give them enrichment enrichment is a is a really good part of having your guinea pig happy it really helps them like they, it makes them stimulated and you need to make sure to give your guinea pig enrichment. Do take them out for floor time. Guinea pigs could do with floor time. It's a change of scenery, it's more social interaction and just everything about floor time is really good for guinea pigs and when you take them out for floor time make sure that they've got a blanket for their paws and make sure that you supply them with hidey houses when you take them out for floor time but overall floor time is like an amazing option to also help bond with your guinea pig so do make sure to take your guinea pig out for floor time Do interact with your guinea pig. Guinea pigs need social interaction and basically just keep on checking on them and keep on spending time with them and just interact with them. As I said, floor time is a great option and just make sure to interact with them. They are amazing creatures and you just need to interact with them and give them what they need and yeah and so make sure to interact with your guinea pig and do be patient with your guinea pig after all guinea pigs are prey animals and at the end of the day we do need to understand that so just give them time to settle in and just try to not tower over them as well and give them treats and just let them be themselves and they will really come around in their own time and they'll start exploring in their own time 
So we should always supply them with hidey houses to make sure that they feel safe. And yeah, um, guinea pigs are really great creatures and you just need to give them time to come around. And yeah, when you've given them time and you're patient with them, they will really show their true character in, before you know it. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video, I really hope you guys learnt something new about guinea pigs and as I said this video is a collab with two crazy guinea pigs so make sure to subscribe to her channel, it's awesome and lots of guinea pig care and lots of guinea pig cuteness on her channel so yeah make sure to go and check it out and I really hope to see you guys next time, please subscribe and like this video and yeah, we'll hope to see you guys next time. Bye! Whiskey! <laughs>